The ongoing heat wave has hiked the use of air conditioners, raising worries about power shortages. A local company developed a system that lets you reuse the heat from air conditioners for heating purposes or to supply hot water. Although people are aware of the importance of power saving, it's difficult to put that knowledge into practice with the ongoing summer heat wave. Sales and the usage of air conditioners are steadily increasing every year. Here we are at a kindergarten which opened early this year in Osan of Gyeonggi Province. Keeping an ideal temperature inside the building during the hot and humid summer is very important for the children's health, which calls for the use of air conditioners. As air conditioners cool down the inside temperatures of a building, it blasts hot air outside. This heat, which was overlooked thus far, is being recycled to create hot water or heating by being collected into a heat pump in this system. This system, which was developed and launched in South Korea in June, uses a heat waste recycling technology, which stores high temperature heat waste and then produces hot water from the heat. While air conditioners absorb heat indoors and emits heat outdoors, the heat pump works reversely. 실외기는 공냉식이나 수냉식이나 지열이나 다양한 열원을 활용하여 온수를 만들 수 있는 저탄소 친환경 제품입니다. As air conditioners based on the heat pump technology are equipped with functions for hot water supply and heating, it is bringing a wave of changes to the local boiler market estimated at 100,000 units. It saves fuel expenses as it can create more than 2,700 kilocalories of heat out of one kilowatt of power. Furthermore, its low-carbon, eco-friendly product as its carbon dioxide emission is 52 percent, less than that of a ton of oil, with a figure of 48 percent. According to the International Energy Agency, if fossil fuel-based water heaters around the world are replaced by the heat pump water heaters, it will reduce the annual emission of carbon dioxide by 8 percent. 하반기에는 효율이 개선된 대용량의 제품이 출시 계획 중에 있습니다. 해외의 경우에는 가정용 제품은 수년 전부터 이미 판매가 되어지고 있고 상한용 제품은 내년 12년도부터 판매에 들어갈 계획입니다. Recycling heat waste from air conditioners to supply hot water and extracting heat energy from hot water in sewers are among the examples showing the dawn of an era where total energy will hopefully be near zero. South Korea is expected to lead the global market in these areas of environmentally friendly technology, which is attracting attention worldwide.